Hey everyone, Thornton Smash here, and we are less than two weeks away from Season 20 of Apex Legends. And with that, there seems to be some disappointing news coming from a new insider, which we will go over today. Along with that, there is some good stuff coming as well, but it might not be enough to really lift everyone's spirits. Along with that, we're going to go ahead and give out some of these skins in the store rotation this week. All you guys got to do is like, comment, subscribe, and a winner will be announced in tomorrow's video. Without further ado, let's jump into today's topic. All right, so we do know that Season 20 is right around the corner. We've gotten a lot of teasers. We've even seen stuff about the new district map where... There's there's a breach at Humbert Labs, and all residents of the Electro District had to evacuate, and this is the homeland of crypto. We've seen little teasers of it, but it does appear that there looks to be some changes going into Season 20. First thing to know is that there is a video out by a name known as Exo. He's a French leaker. You can see his video right here where it says Season 19, and then Season 21 is uphill, but Season 20 is still at the bottom. Now, you might be wondering, well, who is Exo? He's actually a really well-known leaker in France. He's given us stuff like the anniversary heirloom, last year being shards, and overall, he's actually been a very reliable source on a lot of different content creators and leakers and I can confirm he does actually have information and in this video he goes over a lot of really interesting stuff that seems to actually line up especially when you take a look at Hypermist's recent theory on how he has the heirloom set up with Newcastle actually still on the list with his sword the Bloodhound heirloom recaller looking to be sometime after Octane's prestige and a couple of other things and the reason that is interesting is because respawn has been rapidly changing what's coming and when we had entire skins designed around Rag Army and Rag night now exo's video is actually in french you can still watch if you'd like to and turn on subtitles but i talked to him directly and this is what he had to let me know about what we can be expecting in season 20 i'm going to start with the good news next gen patch will be coming with 120 frames per second at least it seems so at some point in season 20 but it will be a downgrade and downscale option to reach 120 likely that means 1440p 1080p something not that's going to be 4k so do be aware of that however outside of that he had some concerning news season 20 apparently has no legend no new weapon and no map update you can see my response there so what's coming in season 21 that's like sending the game out to die you let me know some basic information such as that octane is the next prestige skin and lifeline will have a prestige with her own rework probably season 21 or 22 although he did comment on one of hypermist tweets saying that lifeline prestige seems to be coming in season 21 we do know that hypermist did confirm that there is a mythic skin for lifeline in the game files oz has also let us know that lifeline reborn isn't likely coming till season 22 or 23 although it does seem like it's going to be coming a little bit sooner now based off of this new information Honestly, I'm a little surprised that we're still not getting a new map if the leaks by EXO are correct, which I do believe they are. Originally, when I got my giant list of leaks, they actually said the new map district would be coming in season 23. It had been moved up, then pulled back. I talked to another inside source just to say what I had heard and see if they had heard anything else as well. They just confirmed that they've heard a lot of bugs and everything is being rushed right now. It wouldn't surprise him at this point. The development news he's been getting his points to major issues with the new map out of nowhere. And he did hear some stuff about the new rank system that's going to be different, not quite reverted to the way season 12 or 13 is going to be but apparently hidden mmr is supposedly staying which if they decide to do that it's just going to be the dumbest thing i've ever seen that's one of the biggest complaints about ranked exo did let me know some final information such as there was a play test last week for ea creators apparently there is a broken moon update for 2024 which i mean also kind of makes sense before we get a new map because we've had broken moon for a year and there hasn't been any changes which has never happened before he also said it's probably heirloom charts for an anniversary event overall i'm going to be a little bit interested especially what that means about cave we have have actually this is probably the least we've ever known about a next legend coming only that cave was found in the game files and he has some kind of teleport ability through walls that was actually due to a play tester not anything found in the files once again everything needs to be taken with a grain of salt i personally believe exo and my other people that have told me this stuff but nothing's ever 100 confirmed until respawn actually shows it and they have been very hush hush and quiet and kind of bamboozling people as of lately so there's always a chance that this is a giant misdirection which i am actually really hoping it is because if season 20 doesn't have any new stuff coming and it's just a next gen update which don't get me wrong i still want the next gen update but it's going to be a little bit of a letdown especially with how long this current season has been put it down below what are your guys' thoughts on season 20 of apex legends if it doesn't have some of these features players have been waiting for for a very long time are you gonna be upset or are you just happy that next gen will be coming on the console and don't forget to check out the channel right here by my editor nobel who does amazing apex legends finals and other content until next time everyone keep slaying the outlands i'll see you out there